and whoever loses his life for my sake will find it. Without salvation, we cannot have anything else. Without salvation, there is no bridge to heaven. Without salvation, there is nothing that we can do to go be with the Father and to be with Christ. And this is one of the things that we have to realize. Things on this earth, your relationship with God, your relationship with everything is you and God, not your families and God. Every single one of your family members, they have a separate walk with God. And Jesus is saying here in Matthew, do not think that I have come to bring peace to the earth. I have not come to bring peace, but a sword. Whoever finds his life will lose it, and whoever loses his life for my sake will find it. Not only does God a merciful, agape, loving God, but God wants a relationship specifically, sovereignty with you. Well, Jesus and, this, and the disciples have departed from Capernaum, and they are walking into Samaria. And Jesus stops at Jacob's well, and he tells the disciples, go ahead and go on in the town, go get some food. And a woman appears, a Samaritan woman, and now she's alone. So a lot of people don't realize in the culture uh, back then, all of the women would walk together to the well. It was not only to be in a group to stay protected, but it was very hot in the Middle East during the middle of the day. And so this woman was walking alone, and Jesus asked her for a drink. And when Jesus asked for a drink, she says, you're asking, you're a Jew. You're asking me, a Samaritan woman, for a drink? Jesus said this, verse 24, God is spirit, and those who worship him must worship in spirit and truth. The woman said to him, I know that the Messiah is coming, and he who is called Christ when he comes, he will tell us that he will tell us all things. Jesus said to her, I who speak to you am he. This lady leaves her water, she leaves everything, she runs out back to the town, she goes, I'm gonna tell everybody everything. That's salvation.